Morning everybody, today is Universal Day. Emily's currently weighing, we're running late, as standard. Just gotta show you what I'm wearing. <laughs> that toilet is so loud. So I've got on my Magical Day Apparel Hogwarts at Night black t-shirt, my little snitch necklace that I think I got from H. Samuels and I've got matching earrings, just a Gryffindor lanyard, Gryffindor mask, Gryffindor scrunchie, and this skirt was a kind of a joint gift from my parents. My dad bought the fabric and my mum made me the skirt out of it, so thanks guys, I love it. Other than that, all I've got is my Gryffindor Danielle Nicole backpack and this to put my camera in. And I'm gonna pass you over to Emily so she can show you what she's wearing and I can go for a wee. There you go, have fun. Thanks. Thanks. So, Magical A Day t-shirt. The reverse one to Megan's actually. Shorts, Jack Wills actually, I think. Lanyards just from Amazon, I think. And my scrunchie. Here's ever after. There we go. I really want to go to Universal. And you were like, same. And I said, well, if we're getting the three for two park tickets, we need to still use We need to make sure, Bay. make sure that we come enough to make it worth it. Yeah. And we've actually, instead of two times, we're putting it in three. three. We didn't even, our second day we came to Universal, we literally came to do like two hours in the evening. So in we didn't Ireland's even, an adventure. Yeah. We are on our way to a voodoo donut because that sounds like a great breakfast. We don't really know what we're doing yet. We're just going to look at queue time, see what's going on. And yeah. But whatever we do, we're going to have to get in a queue because we've not got express pass today. Yeah. I mean, we could have prayed, but... We could. Well, well, we can see how today goes. And, and then, then next potentially time... Potentially for next time. Maybe the last time we're here. The second time we're here, we are only here for like a few hours. We're doing the water rides, and then we're going to Volcano Bay. Is Ooh. it open yet? Do you want to get me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's great. Thank you very much. It's so cool in here. <laughs> so there's this little turnstile in the middle of the queue where you can see what all the donuts look like before you come to the front. But it's really overwhelming because there's like a million. <laughs> Talk me through what donut you got. A uh, sprinkle cake. Just a normal sprinkle donut. So, I don't know if it's got any filling in it. Okay. No. No, sometimes. <laughs> Have you got I'm a free hand to just hold this for a second? I'm not a fan of filled donuts. I went for a bit of a purple. No, because I was worried I was going to buy it in the big custard because I don't like that. This thing is huge. <laughs> <don't want> <laughs> The universal orange sickle one. I'm a bit scared it's gonna drop. It smells really nice. It's on a massive stick. <laughs> 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 it's filling in there, I just can't get to it. There might be filling in mine and I've not got to it yet. Out of ten? It's like a nine out of ten. I'm glad I didn't order two. 
I nearly panicked because Hannah ordered another one. And you've got a coffee. Yeah. You really have to persist there if you want a photo with the ball facing the right way. Wait six years for it to turn around so it's facing the right way. Can oh. you feel the Did we want to take another one being this close? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not waiting again. Where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> Mardi Gras! Mardi! <laughs> Mardi Emily! God's sake! This is right. We're gonna be here till 10 pm. Yep, we're gonna try. Toilet. I'm afraid my specialty is restrooms in Disney. I'm not as good here. Oh, this was where Shrek was, wasn't it? Oh, oh R.I.P. Shrek. That was our first ride last time. Great as well. It was good. We had Shrek all on us. We did, and it was glorious. I hope I don't get copyrighted for all this music. Might do. God damn it, Universal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is Rip Ride Rocket. We'll be doing that at some point. We didn't get a chance to do it last time. No, that donut will be making another appearance. Restroom! I found the toilets. It feels really empty when obviously it isn't. Everyone will be at Tiger God Alley, yeah. Let's go join them, shall we? Yarp. Yarp. Oh, this makes me so sad. Why are the lights on? We're opening late summer. That's so rude. There's Simpson stuff over the lake. There is the King's Cross station that looks something like King's Cross. Yeah. Hi, Piggin. Would you follow us from so King's like, Cross? Is that the equivalent of a Disney duck? We've got Universal Pigeons. Well, we're back home. We are. Right. Are we ready? Just like going into a new universe. Oh my god. It's the dragon game too. Look how empty the end bit is here. Oh, oh is it going to breathe fire? interactive ones and they're supposed to be able to do things when you cast the right spell but um, it looks harder than you'd think this one obviously pours water over the umbrella so I'm trying very hard not to get too close in case it all of a sudden rushes escape from Gringotts was absolutely amazing right. we rode it last time we were here but I don't I don't remember it being that good Maybe it's because we've been away for so long. We appreciate it more this time. So yeah, when you go on, I want to buy everything. I want to buy everything too. When you go on rides like Escape from Gringotts, Hulk, uh, previously the Mummy, Universal have got these lockers where you have to put all your bags in. Um, which everybody trying to. And a lot of time they only let one person go in with everyone else's bags. So just be wary that that is a thing. Um, if you're coming it might be worth measuring how big the bag is that you're bringing because the lockers are really not very deep. This is travel agents. Why would I want to travel anywhere else? Oh wow, there's the aircon. 
all the key rings and all the bags. So don't need another cup. That's a ninety-two dollars <laughs> one. I screamed myself hoarse on that ride. I'm so excited. Oh, what a <laughs> There's ones by Gorovich. There's Ollivander's in there as well. So there's a sweet shop there. Dung bombs. That's what you've been releasing. Really? <laughs> oh, look! This is what we're having for dinner. <laughs> We're looking at the menu for the leafy cauldron. Oh, I didn't know they did special breakfast. Pancake one. I mean, that that was what drew my eye to. Should we go in Weasley Wizard Weezers and the Quidditch Supplies Shop? Oh, they've got pick me puffs. I already have both of them. Look at the big ones. Look at this t-shirt. Oh, it's like a nighty. <clears throat> oh no! I know. <laughs> Look how cute they are, his little head. Oh. Hello! Hello! I like the little key rings. Ah, oh, this is a. Is this a Daniel Nicole? Yeah. How much yeah. do these retail at? $79 plus tax. What the heck is that? Wizard. Weavers. Bloody hell, that was a tongue twister. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh look, I like this. That's not a Yeah. Is this a notebook? Potentially. Yeah. Sure. I like that. Uh oh. I have a very vast notebook collection already at home. Oh, nearly fell up the ramp. <laughs> Would you like some jelly slugs? I do. Help. Soft and chewy gummy treats. So we've got all your usual Harry Potter snacks. We've got peppermint toads. Kissing Whisbees. There's what's every five beans, chocolate frogs. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Whenever the people buy a pygmy puff, I think they do a naming ceremony. My pink pygmy puff that I have at home is called Fred. And then the purple one is called Frederica. <laughs> this mannequin's pretty creepy. I love my one of these. They're so expensive though. Well, we didn't obviously pay dollars. I think they're like 85 pounds. I have. Remember when we went and tried them all up? Oh my god, yes. I have that too. That's my Disneyland Paris umbrella <laughs> that I use to keep people away from me. Oh my gosh, look at his little scarf. I know, that's why I want it. Oh, I love him. How much do you pay for the scarf? $30. I don't think that's too bad. No, it's not. Oh, I love him. No Ooh, cuddly boy. toys, Graham Hall said. But I don't, Graham Hall's not my dad. He's mine. I want to hug him. Look at his hair, his little mane. Oh, look at the badger. Have they got snakes as well? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> With a scarf on. I like the badger only because he's cute. He's so funny the way he like fell off the shelf. And then this is... Let's tuck him back on. There's a raven for a raven claw or a crow. I don't, I'm never fully sure. It'll be a raven, won't it? I would have thought that, but it's the only one that is... Oh, I like it. Sure the wings are blue. The same. I think they do as a well. Rook, a raven, a crow. Does it say... By rook or crook? No, I liked the snake. That was really funny. Oh, this is a good bag. This is a good bottle. I'm all about the bottle. Yeah, this, this is a great part bag because of the size that of it. Nice. I like that. You could fit your sun cream and my camera in there. Let's open it. They always do Hufflepuff the dirty. Hufflepuff's That's always cool, black. You don't see yellow. The zip. Yeah, invisible zip bags. Yellow! Oh, it's got a back pocket. Oh, 
potentially purchase later. That's, that's a really good that might bag. do me over. I quite like this in a really bizarre way. So thirty-seven dollars for this t-shirt. Not being funny, but this badger looks like a lion. It does a little bit. They've just copied. I, they're basically. It's just less fluffy. Look. Basically, they basically look the same in my eyes, mm. potentially. That's, that's, that, is, that is so rude. Shall we exit for a bit? Jesus, I need my sunglasses out. Where's the sun come from? So I think we've decided we're going to go head towards Rip Ride Rocket. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. Bus <laughs> merch is just the night purple. Here's the vibe, but I don't feel like I need merch just for the night bus. Um, or do I? You've got merch of everything here. <laughs> you best not change houses now. Oh god no, <laughs> absolutely not. Saying that, I have got a lot of Slytherin merch, but just because I like it too, so. Especially I, the backpack. Yeah. But I am a Gryffindor. You're a Gryffindor too, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah, of course. <laughs> it's so cute. My, um, my dad, I'm pretty sure he'll be watching this. Hi dad. When we go to the studio Hi, tour. Steve. My dad always wears like Gryffindor stuff as well. He's like, because I'm supporting your house. And it's the cutest thing ever. And he's given me a hat to bring with me on this trip because, you know, I don't want to burn my head. So he's like, here, have this Gryffindor hat. He's a supporter. He is. <laughs> I feel broken. <laughs> that, was, that was so funny. I, <laughs> I didn't realize they filmed you like in the seat in the front through the whole thing. Our video is the ugliest thing I've ever seen in my whole life. Right. Right, where are the toilets? Around here? Yeah. Oh my god. That's my scared face. I listened to I built the bath the whole way around. It was excellent. And you listened to the Black Eyed Peas, weren't you? Yeah. Which one? Pump it. Oh. That was so funny. Oh. Yeah, it throws you around a lot. Like, I had my head pressed to the back of the chair, but it was still, like, rattling around. This is the Jimmy Fallon ride. 25 minute wait for this, so we thought, yeah, let's do it. This does not look like a 25 minute wait. Yeah. This is very exciting, guys. In a few minutes, we're gonna go head to head in a high speed, action packed race through New York City. Yeah, that was really good. Oh, I do not know. Should we go find ET? Yeah. Let's get the map up. We have found a diner. Home from home. On the search for ET. I don't even think we came round here last time. Probably not. I've never seen this. No. Cornell Diner. No. What on earth is this? Is this Dora? Dora. You dancing? Come on, swipe no swiping. <laughs> How funny. Even dressed up There's a backpack and a map. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> yeah, boy, this way. How funny. Why are they gonna back up? We found it. Oh, oh good. We We're in the kids' zone. Oh, a babe sheep pig. Got the Madagascar ca characters down there. I can see Alex the lion. Oh, I can see um, Tiger from. There's Tiger from Kung Fu Panda and um, King Julian. Yeah. <laughs> so funny. Look, he's here. We've got Mystery Inc. here. Very random that Fred's wearing a mask and none of the rest are. <laughs> Just in the queue for ET. <laughs> this is another one that said it was going to be like a 15 20 minute wait, but we've walked straight on. This is so cool. It's like a forest in here. I'm obsessed by Mystery Ink. I think that's so cool. 
Oh, well, let's go through. Let's go through the ET gift shop. Oh, look at him holding a heart. Oh. Yeah. What the heck is that? <laughs> well, I don't feel like um, we need to ride that again. <laughs> We're at Springfield. Here is the DeLorean time machine. Bumblebee. Man's tacos. I love the lard lard donut. Amazing. Is this where you can buy the big massive donuts? There's the crusty burger. I only watch The Simpsons late at night when it's like on repeat. He's terrifying and I can't even see his face. That's that. This is the ride, look here. Crusty in the end. What's the wait time at? That'll do. Is it what, sorry? It probably won't be. I know, well, we've not waited for anything yet. Congratulations, the line's almost over. Only 45 more minutes. Just kidding. Lock I have sitting. no idea how much longer it is. So here to entertain you are Itchy and Scratchy. That's me. Uh, hey, those are just too drunk. She was down the <laughs> That's a lot. Simpsons ride is good, but like, honestly, it was just another simulator. So we are now heading for Men in Black. Potentially. Hoping so we can find it. 35. You wanna wait that? Yeah, that's fine. That was so fun! I know. All the theming inside is like really, really good. Considering they've only got like one ride per section, you know, like they really go all out. So are we heading back around to Diagon Alley now? Yeah. For lunch. Luncheon? We are both starving. Right, is it through here? Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. one way one way out. Well, we've broken the rules. Oh, we've come in a different way. Oh yeah, we've quite a different way. There is some magic going on here. Because it falls all wet. Here we go. Yeah, it's got the proper menu now, so obviously it must be lunchtime. So, I want... <laughs> yeah, I want fish and chips. Fish and chips! Where's the toad? There. Oh, that looks great. So excited. Huh? Are you sure? Yeah. I am so unbelievably excited for this, it's unreal. I love it in here so much. All those kegs of butter beer at the back. So we're pretty sure this is like exactly where we sat last time, so there is the vegan culture. So you've got a lemonade that's very, very, I thought it'd just be like a Sprite. I don't know. Taste it, is it like fresh lemonade? Squeezed. Can I try some? Just a little sip. Wow, that is sour. And our food's here. So I've got the fish and chips here. Where is my butter beer? That I'm going to chug. And then what? Did you get toad in the hole? Can I some veggie? Can I have a look? There's some actual health on it. Oh yeah, oh it's got gravy, that looks so good. Look at that broccoli. Just that one little bit. That one sprig of broccoli. <laughs> Absolutely smashed that, that was so good. I just think it's so pretty in here. 
it totally just feels like you're in the movie, which I know is the point. But. What did you think to lunch? Brilliant, except for that onion. That's not fish onion, that was nasty. That thing. Sloggos. That was worse than French onion soup. <laughs> what do you think to your lemon drink? Weird. They don't do like normal sodas and stuff in here. You can get water, obviously. That's boring though. And they do apple and orange juice, but obviously this stuff can't. Is it can't Oh, nearly. No, I don't think it is. Well, I'll have some more of it if you don't want it. <laughs> I'm trying to overdo it on the liquids on purpose to stay hydrated because I don't want to get really sick. <laughs> by this bloody dragon. Come on. That was legit. <laughs> Let's go into Madame Mulkins. Wow, it's cold in here. This is the mirror that like insults you when you walk past it. Right, you, you walk past first. Oh, I like these bags. Now, is there a Gryffindor one? Is it around the other I side? Because... Are the Gryffindor ones around the front? <laughs> She's going back to the mirror. Absolutely. Well, you know what? what does she say to you? It might be best to rethink that purple. Oh, dear. Wow. Oh, this is like. Oh, I like that. I want to try one on. <laughs> In the mind, in the mind. Hi, <laughs> This is quality content right here. Thank you for this. Let's have a look. <laughs> the label makes it. <laughs> right, I want to try no, it. I need some air. Uh, <laughs> having a bit of a mare. Megan. <laughs> Five. Why is the label on top? <laughs> I don't understand why there's like a knob in the middle of it. You look like a telly tubby. Thank you, Winky! sliding off my head. Dipstick! Lila! <laughs> right. That was not worth all the effort. You can definitely put them back because I. I want this! Why don't we put <laughs> Creating quality content. <laughs> so unnecessary. So this is Ollivander's, I think. Wowzers, it's cold in here too. This is so cool. Fred Weasley. Mad Eye Moody. Did you look at which one it was that you wanted to buy? I want Harry's. Oh, you want Harry's? But I don't obviously want to get it here because I know to carry the box around with me. Yeah. They're heavy, aren't they? <laughs> How much are they here? Let's sit back together. Okay. 58. They're 58. Shall we go down into Nocturne Alley? Yeah. I think Nocturne Alley is here to the left. Oh, here's Gloria Fortescue's. I'm going to need a wee before we get ice cream. Oh, yeah. Yay, someone was successful at their magic. Well done. 
done. Uh, I think we can go this way as well. Oh, it's cold. Skelly Grove. Ooh. It, yeah. There's a sign. Yeah, it's so dark. Oh, it's dark and cold. Yeah, it does. Oh. Wow, this is creepy down here. Ooh. So when I trip over you, it's so dark down here. <laughs> it's like Hollister, you're right. So we've been to Florian Field School and we got two scoops of ice cream. These are massive. I got sticky toffee pudding with a bum flip on it. <laughs> that special flavour. What, so you got sticky toffee and? Sticky toffee. Oh, just two scoops of sticky yeah. toffee. So I got apple crumble and then Earl Grey and lavender sounded interesting. So, yeah. So we are now walking to go and hopefully get on the Hogwarts Express. Can we go to the night book first? Um, or should we just get on the Hogwarts Let's just we go. Need to we need, can't do everything on the first day. No. Oh, the trains are going to lose the Amazon. Oh. <laughs> the whole trains. Oh, you need your park ticket. Oh, the dungeon. Yeah. That ice cream was so tasty, but I feel like I've cut my lip. The cone? Oh, I don't think I have it. He's just swollen. <laughs> I'm delicate, okay? And that waffle cone was like rock hard. <laughs> oh, but you it too quick as well. I've got hiccups. The apple crumble flavour. Elite. It was literally elite. How was sticky top and pudding? Great. <laughs> Great. The apple crumble flavour was amazing because it had actual bits of like crumble and like cake in the ice cream, so. Yeah, that was like mine when I got round of good. It. So good. The Earl Grey and lavender, I can really taste. It was just like, it was nice, but it didn't like jump at me. I was like, oh yes, I know exactly what this tastes of. So, next time I want to try the clotted cream. Yeah. But I also like the thought of trying the soft serve. But yeah, this is the queue for the Hogwarts Express. And if you didn't know, the Hogwarts Express it is basically it's a, ride as well. it's a ride, but it's also how you park hop. Oh no! This is such a long queue. Home from home. Hagrid's, isn't it? Yeah, should we just see what's it is? Yeah. So it's 80 minutes. Oh, really? Shall we do it? We might as well. Yeah. Okay, we aborted that plan. We couldn't find the end of the queue and then we turned around and it went all the way back out of Hogsmeade, so I'm not sure what that's about. It did definitely said 80 minutes on the app and on there, but I don't see how that can be 80 minutes. Yeah, we're gonna head around and do Forbidden Journey instead. Because that is only 45, I think. It's so busy. Like, you can't walk without people jumping out in front of you. There's Hogwarts. Oh my goodness, look how many people there are. 35 people. But then, you have to walk that way to the lockers and that way to the ride entrance. It's not existing, really. Yeah, that's confusing. I think the trick for Universal is to come without a bag, but I don't know how you would do it. Not when you've got sun cream and lotions and potions. No. So, thoughts of Forbidden Journey. That was great. I'm still terrified of that ride. Yeah, I, next time you need to sit on the I end. I think we you don't see um, half of the big thing. I really want to enjoy it, but I just like absolutely ter terrifies me. Because I'm I'm funny about mannequins and things like that. So. I did do well on ET. Thank you. I mean, ET was slightly less scary because they're not a foot from your face. Okay, now we're gonna try
try and find the queue for Hagrid's. We were unsuccessful earlier because we got confused because I think they had a split queue going on to fill to people down for the Hogwarts Express and also across for Hagrid's because of where they're positioned and we were confused. <laughs> so take two, we'll try again. Hopefully we're more successful this time. Right, yes. So you have to leave Hogsmeade to get into the, which seems very bizarre. All right, here we go, we found it. Found it. All right, so we've got to queue now to put our bags away again, and then we'll start a timer and see how long it takes to get on. It broke down. We've got an express pass there. Let's go back. And everybody's waiting outside for it to be open. Oh, I wanted a butter beer. Where, where can you get the frozen stuff from? Next? We're on the frozen bus beer and bus beer ice cream. So we're in the three broomsticks now. Hopefully, this is where it's at. Look at all that. What is that? Is that like corn? Corn. Like, now that is a hot plate. The mood I'm in right now, I might get a frozen butter bit and a normal one. So I've got, I think this is the frozen one. The normal one, they're slightly different colours. And you've got ice cream. Is it good? Perfect. Emily's really low down in her chair. Oh, the problem is, look at the chairs, they've got teeny weeny little legs. So this is the three broomsticks. This seems to have got a lot more seating than the leaky cauldron does. So verdict on these. Obviously the original one is 10 out of 10. The frozen one isn't as sweet, it's like a slushy. You prefer the frozen one, don't you? Yeah, I don't really like it a bit. I like it like this. And that's what that is. Yeah. Really good though. Right, we think Hagrid's is back open. We can see people on the coaster, so hopefully, hopefully we can go and ride it with our new express passes. They gave us when the ride shut last time. We are going now. Yes. Let's do it. Yes, babes. Did I vlog after we got off Hagrid's? No. Update. Update. We got back on. We came out of the three broomsticks and the store was open. So we're like, let's go see. And we got on. And we got on really quick. And it was like a solid 15 out of 10. Wasn't it so good? I want to ride this again. I was going to say, the, the problem bike. is now we want to go on it again. If it had been mediocre, we would have been like, that's cool. That's it. Done. It was absolutely amazing. Um, so yeah, I'm so pleased that we hung around there, otherwise we might have missed it coming back up. So yeah, now we are trying to find the entrance to the Velocicoaster. Oh, I just nearly fell in a hole and broke my foot. Goal! Let's hope this queue's not too bad. I think I just saw back there, it was 60 minutes, which is no, a win. I mean that, I mean like the queuing, where it queues, etc. because um, Got any liquid with us, both of us? Oh, we a lot of liquid. We have just finished liquid. I, I had two butter beers. Wow, look at this! This is seriously cool. Like, this is oh my goodness! <laughs> there is Hulk over there, over the lake.
Brains rattled around in my head. Uh -oh. Oh. My cat does stays on my hair. Oh. It was aggressive, but it was so good, wasn't it? Screaming. That was us, though. Yeah. <laughs> right, we are now on our way around to the, the original Jurassic Park ride. I'm hoping this one's slightly more gentle. Uh, potentially. I don't mind getting wet, that's fine. We've just come off this. Oh my gosh, that was so funny. Everyone was screaming. Let's we'll see if we can catch it coming down. That drop is basically from the top of that building, isn't it? Yeah. It's so steep. Oh my goodness. was a full boat. Okay. This is a potentially risque move. We neither of us know what this is. I don't even know what time it's at. Is there a lacquer? Okay. Let's go. Well this is a bit creepy. I think it's like a bat simulator. Uh oh. Look at all these skulls. Write me off to death. <laughs> Creepy. It broke down whilst we were waiting. Useless. Savage. Right, where yeah. are we going? We're looking for food. That was so scary, Megan. I didn't <laughs> like it. We were like holding on to each other because <laughs> we, we knew there was going to be a massive animatronic of this bloody gorilla, but we didn't I know got which wet side. From Dino Jewel. Yeah. <laughs> it's very good, but if you are one of the people that goes into the cart first you will have that massive gorilla head right next to you. Thankfully we were the other side. Yeah, I was a bit scared that it was yeah. going to be. Oh, there's food here. What have we got? Oh, there's hot dogs. Yes? Yeah. We both just wanted a hot dog and instead we've got given a monstrously sized one. Look at the size. This, this is a foot long hot dog, isn't it? Yeah. And a pretzel bun. That pretzel bun is quite hard. Right, so we've got some cheese here. I don't quite know how we're going to eat this. I'm scared. <laughs> We're coming to do this on next Wednesday. <laughs> this is cool at night. Fun. Oh yeah. It's like really awful, but yeah. Are we just aiming for the big shop at the front of the park? Yeah. Or the one in City Walk? Or both? This looks cool all lit up at night. Wow, look at it.
been done. La la la. <laughs> and we're on our way out. To bed. To bed. And we've got to find the Uber drop off point. Easy. Oh, there's a sign. We love that. Okay, we're back again. Don't be idiots. Don't be like us. We waited until the park had closed to go up and try and call an Uber. And I checked just before we walked out of City Walk and it was showing about $24, which is what it should be. And I was like, cool, great. Put my phone away. Two minutes later, by the time we'd reached the Uber drop-off point, Emily, what were the Uber prices? I've got a hay fever tablet in my mouth. About $90. It had gone from 23 up to 90 in the space of about two minutes. And we thought, oh, we'll wait, we'll wait it out, it'll be fine. So we sat on a bench for an hour waiting for it to drop, and it didn't. Don't so in the end, we managed to get one for 75 and we just had to pay it. Not, not really very happy about it, but it is now almost half past midnight and we've only just got in bed. Mm. So yeah, maybe, maybe don't stay till park closing if you're relying on Ubers and stuff to get you home. Both of our feet are in shreds. We're having a bit of a moment, aren't we? Oh, darling, that's the worst angle we could. <laughs> anyway, good night. Uh, night. Night. Oh, my feet. <laughs>